It's not just about speed. Speed without agility just means you crash faster. So what we have to be able to do is to adjust at speed to the things that are occurring, the, the kinds of things that are changing. And this is important too, understanding how to be agile. What happens in American business today, and some of you may be from other places, and you'll probably face the same thing, is that we've gotten really good at being really efficient by locking into specific kinds of activities. And that lock-in makes you really efficient, but it also makes you um, far less agile. So what we're going to have to do is figure out how to be much more efficient and more agile at the same time. And that, that means um, devolving responsibility and authority, pushing it down. It means allowing people to make decisions closer to the action of what's happening or what the customer need is. And being able to really turn those decisions quickly, which means in a bureaucratic organization, there needs to be some change. The third thing and one of the more interesting things and where it's really relevant here to a certain extent is this idea of insight. So the question is, as we're competing, what do we know and what do our competitors know? And what do we know that inside our organization we're not taking advantage of? Or how do we get to information that perhaps other people have? And more importantly, when I take all that insight together, how do I make decisions on it? And, and here's the truth of the matter. Most organizations know an awful lot about what just happened. You know, that's the whole, you know, to a great extent, we've been really good at knowing what just happened yesterday or the day before or a week ago and being able to slice and dice that data. What we're not doing so well yet and what we need to be able to do if you're going to compete in this kind of future, the kind of future I'm defining, is to be able to say, what do we think is going to happen next and how do we get ahead of it? Insight is really about how do I get ahead of what's going to happen next and how do I get there before anybody else does? So this is really an interesting question. Where does all that information come from? Where do I get that insight? How do I spend time gathering insights and trends and, and building scenarios so I can begin to predict what's going to happen and get there before anybody else does?